dollar, dollar, dollar. Dirt and money, no so. Had to go and get it, ain't no time to kick it. Got a stack of flip for my foes. Dollar, 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 dollar. Please tell me you can hear me. Don't turn your back and don't declare me. Just let me know if you need me. Dollar, 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 dollar. Let me watch out for my partners. Keep my money long, get my team strong. Let me run away from my problems. Yo, what's good, original crew, man? We back. New 90, well, for us, new 90 day fiance. We got he hired an investigator to spy on his online girlfriend. Now, which one of these do you think did it? Mm, probably this one down here. Oh, you going for that one? I'm going for him. Yeah, I'm going for the one in the yellow shirt. See, I already know by the thumbnail, because I already know who it is. Oh, I downloaded it, so... Okay, you know, well, let me... Since, 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 no, I ain't saying... It don't seem like you. it's not him, because I know you, so that's not no, him. No, I'm not saying this is him or not. You keep looking at this young fella up here. It's purple shirt, red head, him. He he did it. No, I'm not. Yeah, I'm, not keep, I'm looking over here, because I'm looking at the one you see. Final said. answer, purple shirt. <laughs> he looked like somebody uh, did but, too. <laughs> <laughs> well, with that being said, we're going to find out, man. Make sure y'all check out the links in the description box. Down below. You already know where to go, man. You want the first part, you gotta do it. Check out down below. Also, if you enjoyed today's video. Locking it with a thumbs up. Oh, man. It's gonna be a, another 90 Day Fiance. Last one, you said it kind of hurt your head. What's that What's that mahogany one that hurt your head or, or the other one? Oh, I don't even remember. They all do, but I really <laughs> don't remember. But... Mahogany with the being situation, that's the one I said he don't you know say he couldn't just see. Like his Oh he couldn't see straight. That, with the crazy. With the girl that was No, 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 no. That's the one that hurt my head. No, nah, no, nah, you got another one. It's another that's one. Well they all do. I ain't put that one out yet. So, oh. That's the one with the crazy girl. We ain't, I ain't put that. We re recorded. I ain't put they that all hurt my damn head. At <laughs> this point. I already told him like it with a thumbs up. Yep, all right, let's go. Cool. Let's check it out. Let's see what's about. Let's see if see right or wrong today. Let's go. Well, as soon as one season is over, another one just starts right up again. No time to decompress or process what we have just witnessed. It's boom, right back into it. Gino's sitting here with a new hat. Yeah, I got a new hat. <laughs> we are only two episodes into this, and we already have a catfish, a private investigator, and a Gino. This man right here is already approaching David's level of desperation, which if you're pulling that off by episode two, we're talking about record-breaking stuff here. This is revolutionary. To be breaking out the private investigator this soon into a relationship, it's something Thing we've never witnessed before. It oh, brother. No, you ain't, is it? <laughs> oh, that's a head to be the black man. Oh, damn. <laughs> I didn't expect that of you. You said, oh, it's a head to be the black man. God damn. 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 <laughs> okay, well, no, I was wrong. You was looking over there. I was like, in my mind how anyone could think that the beginning to a healthy and long-lasting relationship is paying someone to follow your fiance around and it's not like this guy's being catfished or anything he just thinks she's lying and you know what she probably is the whole thing is just bad all the way around violet is from ho chi minh city vietnam she's beautiful i, nah, I don't even like the name of the city <laughs> oh fuck, bro and she looks so much younger than him Come on now, you. Hey, I understand some girls like like a uh, like a aunt now, but she looking more like granddaddy <laughs> with all that pepper. Child. And when they say they like aunt now, they don't they like a certain aunt now. <laughs> they don't like. I ain't about to. I'm. Mm -mm. Bro, he looks like. Give me some money. <laughs> <laughs> you crazy. Bro, he look like the females are talking. He'll say, "Give me some money." Do he not though? Yeah. Come on. Add all the way around. Violet How much you need? is from Ho Chi Minh City, Vietnam. She's beautiful. I think she's beautiful. She's like, she don't even look her age. I felt like there was a connection. Ever since then, we've just been chatting, you know, and calling each other husband. pretty much daily for two years. Violet is the sweetest jerk I've ever met in my life. <laughs> All right, that's a, sort of a weird way to introduce your fiance. Definitely sensing some bitterness going on underneath the surface there. And you'll notice pretty quickly that they have sort of a strange dynamic. I'm like really, really. Oh, he on FaceTime. I'm about to say, have you ever called call her to talk to her? Because if you call her to talk to her, she, she hits you with the, 
And how old is she? And she hit you with the, hello, my baby. <laughs> 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 the voice is a little too deep, my Oh, guy. my gosh. Okay. <clears throat> really super excited to come there. I'm, I'm real happy. Just. Oh, you love me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not saying that word. <laughs> I don't say I love you. I don't ever say I love you. Because whenever I say I love you to a person, they leave. Uh oh. I I I'm not saying the word, but I'll say this. <laughs> what? Why does he look so proud to admit that he doesn't say I love you? I don't say I love you. So the way they speak to each other and him giving her the middle <laughs> finger and everything could easily just be harmless flirting. Or there could be something bubbling under the surface. And considering this is 90 Day Fiance, I'm gonna go with the latter. So when they first introduce Riley, he talks about two serious relationships in his life that failed. I could be wrong, but I believe he said he was married and his marriage fell apart because he caught his wife cheating. And then in the future, when another relationship was starting to get serious, his girlfriend took off with little to no explanation. He's saying fuck you in reverse to saying I love you because he I said every time it. somebody say I love you, they run away. So, so maybe if I say you. fuck you, you don't want to go. <laughs> you like that? I see what you're doing. The reverse. Okay. Rever okay. okay. Work and work. First, of course, you feel sympathy, but then also I'm wondering, is he leaving any details out? So how do you express your love to her? I don't know. This. this. You know, it just occurred to me how weird it is that we're still blurring somebody's finger. Do you know the shit that Jasmine and Gino talked about this episode? And then they blur this guy's middle finger? I wish they would just blur everything with those two. I'm sick of it already. We're, we're on episode two and I'm sick of them. All right, sorry, getting off topic, getting off topic. It started because Violet told me women in Vietnam mean the opposite of what they say. So when she says she hates me, it actually means I like you or I care for you or whatever. So she knows how I feel when I do this. Oh, okay. So does that mean if you hire a private investigator, what you're really saying is, no, I, I don't want to investigate you. We're, we're cool. Did he sarcastically hire a private investigator? W would she be upset if he didn't do that? Is that what's going on here? We've been through some ups and downs over the last year or so. I just feel that there's something there with Violet that she's just not telling me or she's not being as forthcoming as I would need her to be. I, I, I'm gonna let you go. I know it's late there. Get some rest. Have a good night, okay? Okay. Okay. I'm sorry. It's a little weird, right? That's it's it's weird. kind of strange. Everyone has their own I'm way of flirting. You know, that's cool. They got their own little thing going on. I would think this was a lot less strange if it weren't for all the things that follow. But, you know, like, come on. How far does this go? What is he going to do when he sees her at the airport? Give her <laughs> no, a that's here, Anyway, of course, his friends have to give their opinion on it. So do you love her? Yes. It's just, I don't like saying the word. But... I'm bringing a ring. A ring? It's more like a promise ring mm. because once I f get all the answers <laughs> I need and we can get past what we need to get past, I think she might be the one. Oh, yeah, that sounds... Uh... Boy. <laughs> well, <laughs> Shut up. No, I'm gonna say it cause he got no stuttering problem. When y'all ain't when your your subconscious say, hold the fuck on. <laughs> They're trying to hold the They're trying to hold the words. <laughs> Don't you start. What is this? <laughs> Don't start. <laughs> they Stop! <laughs> Don't start. <laughs> Trying to stop, bro. But it's just, I gotta take it back. No. But that makes, <laughs> oh, shit. Oh. The word. But I'm bringing a ring. A ring. It's more like a promise ring because once I get all the answers I need and we can get past what we need to get past, I think she might be the one. Oh yeah, that sounds, uh, that sounds very reassuring. Once I pay somebody to track her down and find out if she's a liar or not, then I'll know for sure if she's my soulmate. I feel like if you already have layers upon layers of drama and you haven't even met in person yet, then that's probably not a good sign. I asked her often if she was divorced and she said so yes. So you don't know she's divorced? She told me later, like three months in that 
oh, by the way, my divorce was just finalized. But it was three months in after I asked her multiple times. Oh, mm. so you All right, so why don't you just confront her about the lie? And if you're not satisfied with her answer or apology, then just end the relationship. I think it makes perfect sense. Or well, was she already separated when y'all started talking? Because then, like, all right, y'all was separated going through a divorce. Sometimes yeah. divorces take, take time. Mm -hmm. So three months to get a divorce ain't bad, you know what I'm saying? Some people get a divorce and they be like, shit, we finalized this shit next week. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, but some people, they have to get lawyers involved, paperwork, property, yeah. you know what I'm saying? So it depends on how the marriage, because marriage could just be an ugly failed marriage, you know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? And both parties being spiteful. So three months... And she just now said, hey, I just, it could yeah. be she was separated. She was just looking for somebody new. Yeah. And three months in, they're older. So she like, I ain't trying to rush into nothing. But three or three months, we still talking. Like, hey, never know. Be optimistic. Concerned if that's true and she lied about when her divorce was finalized. But if you never address that and now you're always just wondering what she may or may not be lying about and now on top of that you're recreating scenes from the movie There's Something About Mary. None of this is healthy or good or leading in a positive direction and I'm all here for it. I'm ready to watch it all go down. And there's one other thing that she was so adamant that I come off the dating app and I did it and when this whole thing blew up I went just to check and see if she was still on it and she was. Ah, Riley has found himself in a classic conundrum. So I think what happened is they got into an argument about the whole divorce thing and didn't talk for a while. He decides to go on a dating app, the same one that they met on, I assume, and he finds her there as well. Now this proves that she might be cheating, but if you approach her about it, then you also look like you might be cheating. So what are you supposed to do here? So this all seems pretty bad, especially for a relatively new relationship, but it gets a lot weirder when it turns out that Violet has been messaging Riley's dad whenever they get into an argument. I have a about 150 different texts from different days. So wait, okay, 150. 150, you can check it. Oh, don't worry about that. We're just messing around, you know? That's- How the fuck she even got your, 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 your pop dead? Y'all ain't even- Nah, that's, that's weird. weird. Hey, Riley, that's weird. It's our sense of humor. She's totally kidding. You know, I flip her off, she flips me off. We argue, we don't talk for, for like five days. Maybe she downloads a dating app and texts you a hundred times in the middle of the night and says a bunch of manipulative, bizarre things. Let me see. I knew your son doesn't love me and the time we are together, he just loves him himself, really. He never knows how is true love, so he, if he ever will be alone. Really, this Damn. is what she says to you? That's a good one. That is that is such her sense of humor. That is so her. Isn't she just the sweetest jerk you've ever met? And I did not comment on it because I don't want to get in the middle of anything. Man, I actually feel really bad for his father because I'm sure he doesn't want to deal with any of this crap and he's getting dragged into it by these two goofballs. I think this is definitely up there when it comes to worst starts to a relationship on this show. It seems to me that Violet is taking advantage of my father to try to get to me, to manipulate him. He's elderly, he's sick. Like, who does that? You know who does that? My soulmate does that. That is what I look for in a woman right there. It's hard to imagine finding this out and still continuing with the relationship, but you know that he's going to. And on top of that, he thinks that the investigator thing is gonna save his relationship. If you're hired by somebody like this, you probably don't even have to do anything like 90% of the time because the answer is gonna be obvious. This is ridiculous, man. <laughs> yeah. I don't wanna talk about this anymore. I just, oh, really? this is ridiculous. Those text messages just aggravated me. At least this guy didn't try to make a million I mean, excuses and say something like, oh, she kids. was hacked, you know? know. That, that wasn't her saying all of that. But it would be Still ridiculous at this point for him to go and meet her and bring her a promise ring. We're doing a promise ring again, really? What is he promising her? What could he possibly be promising her? I promise that I'll love you forever as long as the investigation clears you. I always felt that Violet hasn't been really giving me the full story about the divorce and not deleting the dating app. So I'm looking to hire a private investigator in Vietnam and in order for me to get the truth. I feel like this show should have its very own investigation service at this point, and it wouldn't require much either. It could just be Big Ed with a magnifying glass. That's about the level of expertise you're gonna need to crack some of these cases. My main concern is, is she really divorced? The other thing I would like to know is, is she still on- Shut the hell up, Sierra. Hey, this time it's her, bro. <laughs> the way she looked at me, I already knew what she was saying.
Cause I was thinking the same damn thing. <laughs> I, ain't, I ain't making no comments, so I ain't made no. I ain't said a word. But I knew what you were saying, though. You like this man don't understand the damn word he said. He just not. That no, fucked no, up. No, see, no. see that mm. fucked. Up. And it's crazy how you know somebody <laughs> that well. You already so when they look at you, you know every word they said. That's crazy. Mm-mm. We around each other too much, <laughs> bro. We work together, live together, stay together, relationship, Do marriage. Day, God damn. Every day. Twenty four seven. God damn. We gotta separate. No, we don't. <laughs> Bro, but that's crazy though. I give you a little breaks. Because I did recognize that he was just shaking his head. I'm like, he ain't understand. Maybe, maybe he just let him, you know, let him speak. The other thing I would like to know is, is she still on the dating app? At one point, this guy said he had an entire list of questions prepared for Violet when he meets her for the first time. So it seems he's planning an interrogation of his own, which is, of course, very romantic. Because she, when we had a big falling out because of one of her lies, I went back on the app just to see, and she was on the dating app using a different name. Yeah, yeah, I see. Well, that's not sketchy at all. And now he's about to give him a copy of her passport. The trust all around is just wonderful. I do have a copy of her passport. Okay. We can find out where she lives. Okay. What she want. Okay. And then we can follow her, check her activity, daily activity to, to find out her relationship. We got our best guy on the case. His name is Detective Ed. If there's anything to find out, believe me, he will find it. But you're not going to like his methods. Of course, we have, we can send you a uh, uh, picture and uh, video. Would you actually, like, get in a car and follow her? Sure. Really? Wow, okay. He was way too excited about that. Why is he so excited about the fact that they can follow her around? This escalated so quickly. We just got introduced to them. This is the second episode, and we already are talking about having a spy follow somebody around. It Isn't it a little bit early for spies and conspiracies? What are, what are we doing? I mean, I feel, uh, ding ding gong gong. I feel, you know, but yes, I, I just, I want to protect myself and, and make sure that... You want to protect yourself by having some guy follow her around and update you with pictures and videos every day? Honestly, this seems like it's going to be one of those couples where they're both just awful and there's nobody to root for. It'll definitely be very interesting to see how this all pans out. Anyway, that is it for today's video. I hope you all enjoyed it. Please have a wonderful week. If you don't, I will. Baby, that's all, that's all the confirmation you need. If you feel like you have to do that, yeah. you don't need to You don't need to be in a relationship. I want, I want a little bit more, though. I did want some more. I wanted to see him follow him around. Well, I needed the you said what? <laughs> What'd you say? Like, bro, I'm telling you, when you, when your, like, when your mouth stopped like that, then your subconscious said, hold on, motherfucker. Slow down. Hold on, motherfucker. You doing bad. something you don't, you don't need to be doing, mm-hmm. bro. I just went. <laughs> don't. My chest hurts. <laughs> <laughs> little, 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 little. Bro, he started sucking his lip. <laughs> I'm not. Yeah, hey, he ain't even stutter. I know motherfucker. Is it a part two to this? I don't think so. Mm, Quiz slice. Need, we need a part two. Come on, Quiz slice. I just want to know what happened. Like, like we need what, some follow up behind what this the one. What the investigator man. found? Come on, Quiz slice. Is she still married? Or he gonna stutter again? Get caught up in his words? Oh no. Ooh, I hit me a good laugh. She got her another man, right? I want him supposed to be laughing like that, though. That's crazy. <laughs> we get a promise ring. I just want to... <laughs> <laughs> I just want to fire. I just want to... <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Shut up. Oh, man, but it's always... I do go with the name DJ the Kid. This is... We are... We are... Go and get it. Ain't no time to kick it. Got a stack of flip for my folks. Dollar, 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 dollar. Please tell me you can hear me. Don't turn your back and don't neglect me. Just let me know if you need me. Dollar, 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 dollar. Let me watch out for my promise. Keep my money long, get my team strong. Let me run away from my promise.